2017 Volkswagen E-Up Review 7. Point. The VW E-Up is a compelling, if pricey, electric city car but it still requires owners to make some compromises. What is it? The Volkswagen E-Up is the pure electric version of VW's popular up city car. When it was launched the EV market was still in its early stages, but now, three years on, the alternative fuel market is bigger and continuing to grow. The E-Up has received a light update to keep it fresh, but nothing mechanical has changed. The main alterations are a revised front bumper and rear light clusters, and aside from that it's all very familiar. As such, its claimed range stays at 99 miles and it's powered by the same 18.7 kWh lithium-ion battery pack that generates 81 bhp and 155 pounds foot of instantly available torque. For a full charge, expect a 3-point plug to take around 9 hours, although a fast charger will take 30 minutes to provide 80%. Although electric cars are growing in popularity, the usual caveat applies, the compromises that their limited range and our still limited infrastructure bring means they have to suit your lifestyle. Still, if you're after a city car, you're unlikely to be covering big miles, so is the E-Up the ideal electric car? What's it like? This is no standalone electric model like the Nissan Leaf or BMW i3. Being based on the five-door up means the E-Up is very familiar in appearance and dynamics. That's no bad thing. The Up is one of the best city cars you can buy, so it's a great grounding to base an electric car on. With instant torque, off the line the E-Up feels much sharper than its petrol-powered equivalent, and its silent cruising makes it relaxing to drive through congested cities. That said, it's not entirely silent in the cabin there's a fair bit of road noise at speed but it is still typically comfortable, functional, high quality, and robust inside. No compromises have had to be made inside to cater for its transformation from internal combustion engine to battery the electric motor sits up front and the battery lies in the floor so it remains spacious by city car standards. It's well specced, too, with a new leather trimmed steering wheel, alloys, heated front seats and a 5.0 in color screen and a smartphone docking station on top of the dash. There's no infotainment system as such, but via a Volkswagen app you have sat NAV and can play music from your smartphone, while the CarNet app lets drivers control the car's charging process remotely and view other vehicle statistics. The E-Up is a pleasant thing to drive with decent, agile handling and a good ride, although its quick steering doesn't offer much feedback. The brake pedal feel isn't particularly smooth either, as with many EVs and hybrids, but the regenerative braking works well and is controlled easily via the gear lever. To further conserve battery power, there are three driving modes normal, Echo and Echo Plus which progressively reduce power and electrical systems to eke out the extra miles of range. Should I buy one? The E-Up faces competition from the BMW i3, Nissan Leaf and Renault Zoe, all of which are great cars and have superior ranges. While the i3 and Leaf are more expensive, the Zoe is cheaper if you buy its battery outright and offers a lot more room inside. The E-Up does come with a generous 8-year, 100,000 mile warranty though, and it's also worth exploring the finance deals available with the car, which make it more competitive. It's still too expensive to be a serious consideration for the majority of car buyers, though, being around £8,000 more than the brilliantly peppy 1.0 liter TSI version of the car, which is quicker on paper and won't be expensive to run. So, although it's great in many areas, until it has a bigger range and a lower price the E-Up remains a niche choice. 2017 Volkswagen E-Up Location Feltham, Middlesex On sale Now Price £20,780, Inc. Government Grant Engine Electric Motor Power 81 bhp at 3000 rpm. Torque 155 pounds foot at 2800 rpm. Gearbox Direct Drive 
Curb weight. 1,214 kilograms. 0 to 62 miles per hour. 12.4 SEC. Top speed. 80 miles per hour. Range. 99 MILES. CO2 slash tax band. 0 G slash KM at tailpipe. 0%. Rivals. Nissan Leaf. BMW i3.